Welcome back to the Conley Clan. Welcome to our dumpster fire, or welcome back to our dumpster fire. If you're a returning viewer, thank you so much. We're happy to have you. Tonight, we are having Freddy's Steak Burgers versus Culver's head to head. That's right. That's yep. Another versus. Pow. We are yep. super excited for this. Mystery Man is with us. Yay, Mystery Man. What's up, y'all? No. <laughs> Broccoli, can we? Yay. Oh, please. Quite dramatic. Okay. And what's in that bag? Nothing. <laughs> All right. Now we can tell you what we got. We got fries. We've got curds. We've got chili. We've got burgs. See what I did there? And we have chicken sandwiches. And chicken sandwiches. Burgs? Burgs. Yeah. And fries. No, it's a Greg witty wordplay. Let's Wait, start with the cheese curds. Okay. It's a great so they're idea. right there and they're already supposed to cheese oxygen. Cheese curds? Thank you, those are Freddy's. Wait, we're starting with those? Dude, okay. You got a big one. Can the camera see This is my fry. Nobody yes. dared to take it. We can see the size of that. Already eating this. Mine, mine okay. is tiny. Squeaky. Yum. Mm. Freddy's? That's mm. good. Really good. Delicious. Give me another, please. Give me more. I'm going to mm. up the ante. I'm really gonna... salty. I'm going to dip the mm. cheese curd in the cheese sauce from Culver's. Unnecessary. Why are you crossing breeds? Why not? Why are you taking a bite? I'll try it as well. Okay. Mmm. Mm. That's really good. Oh, wow. That's Those good. are really good cheese curds. You got to do this. These are really good. Mmm. That's wonderful. Those are good. Mmm. That's good. All right. So Freddy's cheese curds, yum. Culver's? Mm -hmm. Culver's cheese curds mm. now. Dang, y'all. Let's see. Can it compete? Mm. Mm. Oh, the aftertaste is really, really tasty. All right, so Culver's cheese curds. No sauce. Those are so good. The breading. Mm. Very good. Mm -hmm. Let me take a couple. The breading is so tasty. Mm. Try it with the <coughs> sauce. I'm going to Try it with sauce. Thank you. Mmm. Cheese on cheese. Mmm. May I give my opinion? Okay. Mm-hmm. I'll grab some cheese. I, I know my winner. For me? Mm. I think both were super delicious. I'm going with Culver's because I really like the Freddy's. You can really taste the cheese. It was amazing. Mmm. And that with the Culver's sauce was amazing. But... I thought it was kind of too cheesy, and it's not something I would just sit down and eat. Right. So I'm gonna go with I'm gonna go with Culver's because I'm getting another one. Those are I, delicious. I'm gonna completely disagree. I think that no contest Freddy's was the winner. What? What? I think Freddy's right. was quite good. Yeah, Freddy's was. It, won, it was just super flavorful. Like there was just Freddy's a lot more flavor. Like saltier. Basically. Yeah. Mystery Man, what's your opinion? I think they're really good in different ways. I think Freddy's mm. is a lot saltier and it's really, really good for that. Yeah. But the Culver's just tastes like really good mozzarella sticks. But like, the they taste is... like really good mozzarella stick bites. But that's not a bad thing. It's just a different thing. Like, yeah. I think they're really good in their own ways. All right. So Piper is dying to mm. try the fries. The little am. tiny, skinny Freddy's oh, fries. Because look, it's so floppy. And if you guys don't know, I love floppy fries. She is. So these are Freddy's. They're almost like matchstick fries. And then Culver's has these amazing thickies. They're nice and hard. Crinkle. Crinkle cut fries. Yeah. Crinkle cut fries. You want to show them? Here you go, beauty. Oh, okay. Also floppy, but not as floppy. I mean, like, look at so, that. Mystery Man loves Culver's. I mean, that's not even so. floppy. Maybe I just need to pick the right one. So let me find the. I'm going right for the cheese. Really? Because just grip it and rip it. Okay, this one's nice. Which one are you going for? Covers? Mm-hmm. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. That's good. Not bad. Did you try the other one? Try these? Mm-mm. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go Culver's first. If that's cool. So yep, did that's I. already what you did. Yeah. Yeah. And I tried the uh, cheese sauce. I'm gonna go right to the ketchup. I'm not gonna bother. That's my ketchup. Go get your own, Dan. <laughs> you keep on taking my ketchup, Dan. Freddy's has fry sauce to go with there. This with the cheese. Is it good? Okay. Ketchup and cheese. Mm -hmm. Wait. 
Eight. Double dipping? Ew. Where's Where the, um... These are Freddy's matchstick fries. I have claimed They're my fries. very small. Like, very, very, very small. Okay, three, two, one. Mm. I'm gonna try their fry sauce. Actually, I'm gonna try mm. them on their own. Mmm. Wow, salty. Woo! These are good with ketchup. Mmm, they're so thin. They are so salty. For me, I'm going with Culver's. Uh, Freddy's, um, I wish was just a little bit crispier. Mm -hmm. Oh no, I like the floppy, but for me, if it were thicker, then I'd actually be able to taste it really much. Right. Yeah. Because it's hard to taste it, because well, there's not much to taste. Y'all are going to dislike me on this one. I'm going Freddy's again. What? And I'm going to go so far as to say I actually did not enjoy the Culver's fries at all. Why? I just feel like, like, I I feel like they'd tie something I have sitting in the freezer right now, and maybe I'd want the freezer ones more. You say that for every crinkle cut fry, though. Every single one. The Freddy's ones have a distinct seasoning to yeah. them. Yeah, and I like it. I just wish they were just a little bit crispier, but I I, I like them a lot more than I like the Culver's, because I actually liked them. Thanks. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay, I, I like the Freddy's. This might take it even further over the finish line for me the, with Freddy's. The Culver's fries in the Freddy's fry sauce are really good. Yeah. I have to go oh, yeah. Culver. No, mm. no question. No? Okay. Because that's- There's a bit of a dill taste in there, isn't there? In the sauce? Yep. Yeah. Really? Okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah, definitely. Oh! <gasps> Vegetables, kids. Broccoli. Oh, the broccoli. Uh, eat your fries, kids. They're tasty. Oh, no, it's not dill, it's mustard seed. That's what I'm getting. Maybe start with the burgers and then dip in the chili and then go back to the burgers? Sure. sure. We've got two burgers. I don't mind if the road winds a bit. All right, so let's do that. So this is all mine? Yep. Oh. These right, fries pepper. are so insanely good, sorry. Here's your Culver's double. Thank you. You're welcome. That's got so good. Want some, some ketchup for your burger? Oh, they're not, they don't have ketchup? I don't believe they do. Already, I'm gonna say that looks bun. so yummy. Like that looks really juicy there. Mm -hmm. See how the buns looks it looks buttered and toasted. Wait, is that yeah. Freddy's? This is Culver's. Yeah. Culver's. Oh, oh, yours looks so different. Culver's. No, it's not different. It's the Culver's double. Three, two, one. Mmm. Mmm. Yum. That's a pretty solid burger. That's really good. Mm. 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 I was right. It's nice and juicy when you mm -hmm. bite into it. And I also yeah. love how soft that bun is. Like, yeah. that's, that's really so good. good. Oh, mm. good burger. Wow. The beef is so juicy and like seasoned perfectly. Mm. That's really good. And Shaman, what do you think? Quite good. I would much prefer it if it had a slice of tomato on it, personally. Mm -hmm. Add some extra juice, but... Mm. The burger itself is very good. That is so good. All right, so Piper, I'm gonna get our Freddy's ones ready, so it's like close enough to. Oh, there's onion on the Freddy. <laughs> Three tiny little pieces of onion on the Freddy's <laughs> one. <laughs> so this is the Freddy's. If you can see it, three tiny little rings of onion. Oh, we want ketchup though, please. All right, so already as I'm cutting this, it feels <coughs> drier. And looks drier than Culver's. Oh my gosh. I know, that's what I was saying. There's a lot of pickle. You should show our friends here how much, like, the pickles are crazy. I got pickles and onion. Like, it's a crazy up a little bit. Pickle. <laughs> it's a lot of pickle. Oh, sli <laughs> I sliced the pickle in half. Oh, there's no ketchup on yours. Yeah, it does look a little drier, doesn't it? Yeah, even cutting it, I could feel it's mm -hmm. like sawing. Yeah, that's definitely. Okay, ready? Freddy's? Yep. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Mm. Oh my gosh, my burger's like falling apart. Mm. Tastes good. good. Yeah. Drier. Mm -hmm. Dude, there's so many like bits that are falling off the end. Well, of the I already know. I already know what I'm choosing. Mm. My favorite here. Culver's. Yeah, definitely drier. 
What's interesting- Still a lot of flavor. Yeah, I was gonna say the beef tastes like it has ketchup in it. Oh, really? Like some kind of tomato-y, I'm probably completely wrong, but I'm tasting mm. some kind of seasoning. It's, it's definitely not a bad burger. Mr. Man, what do you think? Yeah, I think Culver's definitely wins. Part of me thinks that they put like the the weights on them. I know that's like supposed to be a smash burger, right? If you put the weight on it or... Yep. <clears throat> but just the way this is really pressed out, like look at the way it presses to the edges. Mm -hmm. and part of me feels like that kills some of the juiciness when you do that. Probably. I mean, it probably presses out some of the fat, right? It's supposed to kill the juiciness a little bit and make it a, like have a crisp outside. The broccoli is really good. If you're curious, <laughs> Culver's broccoli is really good. It is it's, really good. It's nicely steamed. Yeah, it's just broccoli. Not much seasoning though. No, yeah. well, there's no butter, no salt. It's just broccoli, which I really enjoy. So, I eat a fair bit of that. Of the uh, Freddy's. Mm -hmm. Like assessing bite after bite. Mm -hmm. I was that's good, it's good. I dry, it's good, but in my head, I felt like I was chasing the bites that I had from the Culver's. So when I put it down, I picked up the, the Culver's again. Mm -hmm. Like immediately, it's just, the flavor comes on so quick yeah. in, the, in the Culver's burgers. Yeah. So we're gonna Are switch you? gears here and try their chili. So this is That's Freddy's Steak Burgers Chili. I'll try it, but... I think it's worth a try. No beans. Mmm. Bless you. That's delicious. Yeah, try a time. No, try oh. a little. There's nothing worse than feeling a sneeze slip into the abyss. I find that most times if I say bless you before someone sneezes, yeah. it stops them from sneezing. Oh, do you? Oh, no. There's no beans. It's just, it's meat and sauce. Okay. Mm. Yeah, the beans were the hang-up for me when I was younger. What is that face? Mm. It's pretty good. Very smoky. Uh-huh. Mm. I like mm. that. I think that would be very good on the fries. Thank you very much. Need some cheese. It's really good on the burger. Oh. Oh. Really, really good on the burger. May I try the Culver's now? Mm-hmm. Mmm. The Culver's has beans. Yeah. You can escape the beans, though. There aren't very uh, many. I, I don't mind having beans. Mmm. Wow. Yeah, there's actually a lot more flavor than Culver's. Yum. Mm. I can't judge They're two very one, different guys. chilies. Mm -hmm. The um, the Freddy's is is more of that smoky chili yeah. flavor that I tend to think of when I think of chili. This tastes like I would say this is chili almost tastes like a really good soup. Freddy's tastes like a chili that you would put on a hot dog or a French fries or a burger. Yeah. Whereas Culver's could stand on its own with toast, crackers, or cheese. nothing. Like I, I'd be whatever. perfectly content eating that just with a spoon. Mm -hmm. Whereas I, I agree that Freddy's, I, I kind of want to put it on something. Mm -hmm. Like I feel like it would be a really good flavor enhancer, but I don't know that I want to sit and eat the whole thing with a spoon. Yeah, it's like ketchup. Yeah, right. Like you wouldn't want to eat a bowl of ketchup. Yeah, like if someone says try this ketchup, you can try and go, ooh, that's really good ketchup. Yeah. But you're not gonna like be like, can I have the rest of that bottle? <laughs> Sorry, can I drink <laughs> your ketchup? <laughs> you can just squeeze it into a cup. It's not gonna happen. What do you think, Mr. Man? You putting on the burger? About the burgers or the chilies? I have been, yeah. Have you? Mm-hmm. Mm, I'm Ready? gonna try that. About the burgers or about the chilies? The chilies. I think the chilies are like the fries. Or they're sorry, both. I think the chilies are like the cheese curds. They're good in their own way. I don't feel that way about the fries. What? The fries I definitely you Actually no, the fries are also kinda that way. What is that cheese intended to go on? Oh, the broccoli? Whatever you want. The two places that seem like they should be You sorted it on its own? Mm -hmm. Okay, I thought it was maybe part of that broccoli mm -mm. that you got. The two places that seem like they should have so much in common seem very hard to compare in terms of how their food Which tastes. Which is kind of fun, because then you could enjoy them both for very, very different reasons. And we still have these chicken sandwiches to go. Oh, yes, not bad. oh yeah. Which is not bad. This is a that. chicken sandwich here, yeah. All right, so we've got one from each. So we, Dad needs to quadrant these. Come back to these. We've only said quadrant once. I will quadrant four uh, Freddy's. That's a nice quadrant. Thank you so much. Freddy's has a very dry chicken burger. This is not taking me much effort. 
This one? That could mean two things, or both. So three options. It could be a much, much more tender sandwich. Thing? Or it could be that I'm just that much stronger than Natalie. Or both. That's fair. So let's do Freddy's. That's all. There's nothing on it? Nothing. Okay. Yeah. Well, that's going to be a big difference in flavor profile. You're putting um, mayo on yours? Yeah. I have ketchup on here. You have chili on there. That's probably why. Chili? No, but I put chili on my oh, I'm going chicken. So How can you taste it then? Tasting it? I don't know any chicken that would. Tastes pretty good. Mmm. Okay. Mm. So my first bite had chili, the second bite did not. This is actually pretty tasty. I think what seemed to be dry was maybe just a crispy outside. Maybe. This just isn't mm. dry. This is good. It's very tasty chicken. Mm -hmm. Good job, Freddy's. It's good. It's not great. This oh came my with gosh, mayo. It lettuce. It came with lettuce. It came with tomato. Mm -hmm. Thank you. This one looks like it's going to be so much better. All right, let's go. Mmm. Mmm. I'm going Freddy's. This is very fresh tomato forward. I feel like, like the bun is saturated in tomato. Yeah, you taste tomato more than yeah. you taste anything else. Yeah, I agreed. I, I, it tastes good, but it, I'm not tasting the chicken all that much. Right. It tastes like I'm biting into a tomato. No, Fre the chili Freddy's is does chicken very better. Good. So I would hazard a guess. That if they have chicken fingers or chicken nuggets or something like that, it's probably better at Freddy's. That's my that would be my guess. You think, yeah. So if I'm going, oh, I really want cheese curds. I'd be going to Freddy's, but nope. I'm not. I'm never gonna go somewhere just for cheese curds. So what's what else is bringing me there? A chicken sandwich? Er, no, probably not. Like it's good, but it's not better than KFC or Popeyes. Yeah, exactly. It's not and good it's enough not on even its own. Big as their sandwiches. There is. Really, only one hope for Freddy's. Oh! And that would be if their frozen custard wins out. Ah. Guys, mm -hmm. this is legendary, biggest fry on earth. Wow. That's pretty crazy. You still have so much burger left. For the food, uh, these are my preferences Culver's French fries, because they grab the most so like mm. when you dip them in the cheese or you dip them in the chili they grab the most because they're crinkle cut they taste really good i really like that they're really uh meaty uh which i really enjoy so those are my favorites the cheese curds also culvers because they had um, a very interesting breading flavor to them the freddy's was pretty much reliant completely on the cheese whereas Cul uh, the culvers had you know the breading was flavored uh burgers Culver's all the way. The steak burger was outstanding. And then chicken burger, I'm gonna go Culver's with the tomato and the lettuce and whatever on that. Yeah, that was really good. My opinions, pretty much the same as mom's, except for I'm going with Freddy's on the last one. All right, Mr. Man, for food, food. Um, and the cheese curds, I really like both of them for different reasons. So I can't really choose there. Yeah. I guess if I had to choose, maybe Freddy's for the cheese curds. Just because it's like a different flavor. But I really like both of them. It's close. And then the fries, they're both good in really different ways. But I have to go with Culver's probably, just because I really like meatier fries. Yeah. Those are the weird skinny ones. Yeah. Um, and then the burger, Culver's definitely. There's a lot juicier. Even though Freddy's might have had a little more flavor, I prefer the Culver's. Okay. Um, and for the chicken burger, I feel like they're also really good for different reasons because the Culver's taste like healthy and fresh. Yeah. Um, but the Freddy's one is more taste the actual chicken itself. And then the chili, they're also really good for different reasons. Oh, I forgot All the chili, food, yeah. All this food like is so different somehow. Yeah. Um, oh. Yeah, the like chili? one of them is more like a condiment and one of them is more like a soup. So I guess, Agreed. So I guess the soupier one would be better because that one constitutes an actual like You can stand item. one as a meal, yeah. 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 Uh, I'm the odd man out on this. I like the Freddy's fries better. Uh, I wish they were just a little crispier, but I still, as is, like them better than the Culver's fries. Culver's fries didn't do anything for me. The cheese curd was hands down Freddy's. Um, I didn't like the batter on the Culver's. It tasted like matzo sticks to me, which are almost always disappointing. The chili, I really liked the smokiness of the Freddy's chili. 
Um, it's kind of what I expect with chili, but Culver's was pleasantly surprising in how much additional flavor there was. I really like the flavors of the peppers that I was tasting there, the beans. Mm -hmm. And I, I think that, like I said, I could just sit and eat a bowl of that, like no problem, like, that's that's a meal. Yeah. Uh, the chicken sandwich, I liked the, the Freddy's better. The uh, Culver's tasted like you could have not had chicken in it at all and I would have had the same sandwich. The burger um, was definitely better from Culver's. Uh, it was much juicier. It still had a little bit of sear, which was good. We'll see where we stand on the frozen custard. <laughs> custard. Battle of the custard. They're both cookies and cream. So what are we going to start with? Culver's. Culver's? All right. The blue spoon? Yep. Can we all get some custard, also? Man. Oh, yeah. Wait, you want some? I'm going to try just one spoonful sure. to say that I did. We're going in on Culver's. It looks really mm. good. You know what's funny? It doesn't, this is mm. going to sound really ridiculous, but it doesn't move like ice cream. No, it's a bit thicker. Yeah. Very, very eggy. Super yummy. That's excellent. Very rich. That's really good. That's wow. sensational. Oh, I like that a lot. Very good. All right, I want to try this Freddy's. It's looking like it's getting melty. Yeah, I agree. All right, so let's go Freddy's now. Which wow, this did actually melt a lot faster than Culver's. Whoa, yeah. My right. spoon's cutting through it like a plastic spoon through custard. Through melted custard. It looks really good. Mm. Culver's is better. Mmm. Freddy's? Culver's is better. Now, you're not going to believe this, yeah? But Freddy's is very good in a different way. Oh, shocker. So, Freddy's, it's all about the mm. custard. And Culver's, it was all about the cookie flavor for me. <laughs> I could taste the Oreo so much more clearly. Yeah, mm. uh, I agree with that. Yeah, Freddy's, it feels like it's vanilla custard with some Oreo bits in it. Yeah. A little bit, yeah. It's a very good custard, though. So, I'm not a... Mm frozen treat savant so i'm going to defer to you guys to tell me what's what but i know my preference is uh culver's i agree with mystery man <laughs> with uh on what that i can't pick one you can't pick one no that one's good if you want a nice cookie so uh, you don't quite agree with mystery man then because mystery man chooses culver's culver's is good i mean so do yeah, i it's good but I mean, they're both good. I just got a huge piece of Oreo in this. Oh, there you go. Oh, um, wow. I just got a huge one, Mystery too. Man got a humongous chunk of... He got an Oreo. Oh, whoops. Yeah. <laughs> wow. That's impressive. <laughs> um, this has been a very long video. Mm. It feels like a very long video. So let's wrap it up. Dad, your favorite? Culver's. Yeah. yeah. Piper? Uh, Todd for me. You're tied. Mystery Man? Culver's. Like your mouth Thank you so much for joining us tonight. If you enjoyed okay. this video, please make sure to like, subscribe, and then comment below. When you hit the subscribe and a little bell pop up, when you hit it, you'll get a notification every single time we have a new video. Every, every single, single time, guys. Every single time. Every single time. <laughs> <laughs> and with that, I'm Natalie. Bye, it's Fiber. I'm Dad. And I'm Mystery Man. And we will see you next time. The Conley Clan says a goodbye. Oh. Ooh.